deer that wants my phone this way. Okay, <laughs> I can do that. That's so weird. Hello, hello. <laughs> Hoping somebody's gonna join me. I have, um, I have a creation to show off. Uh, something that was super fun to make in my group and I love it. Um, so I wanna show you guys how it turned out and I wanna show you, I wanna tell you, what, you'll never guess what it was before I made it. Um, but I made this little sign and here it is. <laughs> and let's see, oh wait, it's backwards, but it's, it's French, you won't be able to read it anyway, probably. Well, maybe somebody out there might. <laughs> let's see here. Okay, there we go, okay. So there, now you can read it the correct way. Now, there's all sorts of little things happening with this that you may not know. First of all, this was a, um, a tabletop. It, I got it at an auction. My friend Beth, that you guys know, uh, she, it was a little spindle table with tiny little legs and the legs were in terrible shape. And so I kept thinking, how can I fix these legs? What can I do? And it was a hinge top. So it was one of those tables that would go like this you know, and it was really yucky. It was not in good shape at all. Um, as a matter of fact, when I painted it out, it crackled. Um, I don't know if you guys can see that or not. I can't see what you can see, but it crackled like that without me even crackling it. <laughs> like it just crackled on its own, which was awesome for this side. Um, I painted it out. I added this beautiful transfer that I found on Etsy. And then I added um, my friend Kathy over at Real Funky Junk introduced me to Diamond Dust. And there you go, you can see the little bit of glitter there in the leaves. Um, as I move it around, it'll catch the light. And then on the flower too, there you go, you can see that. And so I've got Diamond Dust all over it um, from her inspiration. And then I added gold leaf around the edge. So we did all of this in my group. Um, it's called Tammy's Making. And then what else did I do? Oh, and then I gold leafed, I gold leafed um, the angels trumpet if you can um hope, there if you can kind of tell it's a little extra shiny and then i did her wings um the angel's wings hopefully you can see that just a few little markings and then the center of this big flower i did uh, i can't see what you guys can see it made me flip my phone skinny so i can't <laughs> i can't see so we're backwards and we're up and down so okay and I'm not seeing any comments so I don't know if anyone's saying anything but so picture this as a flip top table I have this tiny little <laughs> it's so little so here's my table it's all jazzed out right I absolutely love it and I was just gonna put a hanger on the back and be done okay but there's more to this story so back um, in this uh, in the spring um, what would it have been, May, we were, uh, Julie, my friend Julie and I were at, um, she's the girl I go antiquing with, um, she has a little highlight in my Instagram, because she's my best shopping friend, and you guys will um, love her house, so we did a little tour and showed you what we both, uh, what she got that night when we got home from what we spent the whole weekend. Anyway, so if you want to see what Julie got, you jump over to Instagram um, and find her in the highlight. But we, we do this thing called Janky to Swanky. If you guys remember, we find a, an item that's kind of, I am really a funny color. We find, there, that's better. Uh, we find an item that, that there's two of, and it's always a janky. I mean, they're usually pretty janky, like what the heck is this, right? And we have done um, one, two, why can I think? We've done more than two. Three, I can think of three. We've done three for sure. Um, they're all over on Instagram. I've shared them here as we do it. Uh, but anyway, so this time we saw these two um, pieces off of a piece of furniture. It had been mounted, I'm sure, it was a mirror holder. It had been mounted to the back of a, of a table and then the mirror was mounted here and it was like this was one side and then the other side was, well, you're backwards. So the other side was the other side and then the mirror would be in the middle. Um, so like a vanity, like an old vanity. So I was telling the girls in the group today about this thing and all I see is 
the Flintstones and I see Dino and remember when, when Fred would get off work and he'd go sliding down and take off? That's what I see when I see this. So it's really hard to think of a janky thing um, with this. So I love what I, I love the idea though that I came up with for this. And um, so I, I just messaged Julie a little bit ago because we just did this um, and said, if you don't want yours, I know what, <laughs> I know what I'm going to do. So she was going to make a bookend or two with this for her um, vintage cabinet. So that would be cool too. So I said, well, if you decide you want to sell it, I bet I, I bet there'll be somebody that wants it. So <laughs> let me, let me show you though my idea. Okay. And, and now that I have to have you guys this way, um, so I'm sure there's probably two black things on either side or there will be on on um, um, YouTube because I think my videos share over there I have 423 videos on YouTube isn't that crazy <laughs> okay here's what I want to do I'm gonna make a hanger where, where are you there you are I'm gonna make a hanger and hang this up like this and put chains like a like an old doctor's office sign you know like what would be along the sidewalk and, but it would it would hang flat on the wall because it's unfinished on the back and even if I painted it I don't think it would look good and it's not very substantial like to hang out from the wall but isn't it gonna be cute so I need to paint it so I thought well I'll come on and I'll show you guys all of that and I know someone's gonna be really sick of me because I'm gonna paint it but I am it could I'm used to using chalk paint I'm using country chic uh, chalk based paint that would come um, right off if you um, if you sanded it lightly it'll come right off where are you boy I don't like this thing making me where okay okay wait we're done reading so I'm gonna put at least put it back to normal um, there okay I'm at least gonna put it back to normal so I know where to put this thing so <laughs> it's gonna be an awkward paint job um, but I think I, I think I want it total cover I'm not 100% sure, so um, I'm surely you guys have probably watched a lot of people paint by now with all of this, the years of this, but I'm going to do it really lightly, and let me, and it's back to yellow again, um, let me show you what I do. So I dip into my paint, I'm almost empty or I wouldn't do that, and then you dip here and get rid of it, okay, I'm just getting rid of it so that I can do what they call a dry brush, and then I'm just going to drag it like that. Um, lightly so that you're getting lots of wood still showing through see that so it's not a total cover hi so it's not a total my husband just got home so it's not a total cover okay and then I'm gonna continue and I'm gonna try and leave all of the cuts here that are carved into this thing um, I want to leave those dark I want that dimension and depth and interest okay and I feel like by not covering the entire piece, uh, by not painting the whole thing, it kind of leaves it that old look. Whoops, now I'm grabbing it and it's wet. So I'm gonna leave fingerprints in it. Okay. So that's about all though that I can show you tonight. Let's see here, I'm gonna do this backside, which you can't see, but you can imagine, I'm just painting it. And then I'm just gonna continue here filling it in, getting it a little even, putting a little bit in there, and then I'm gonna even it out. Let me see. Oh, I missed some back here. So, but there's how pretty, see how pretty it's gonna be? So I'm gonna let it dry. I'm gonna lay them all out together, um, but there's what it's, there's where I have so far. I think I need to even it out a little bit more. I still see that. Don't you see like a swan or a duck or like I said, Fred Flintstone getting off work, <laughs> lighting down. I don't know why I see that, but I do. <laughs> so anyway, let's see if we can, let me just see if I can, oh yeah, it's, it's really wet. Let's wipe it off here a little bit and let me, let me do this now that it's not so, let's see, would it go this way with this underneath? Yeah, yeah, I think it's gonna go that way. Let's see, where are you? I <laughs> put you down here. Can you tell? I don't know if you can tell. Um, it's got my phone vertical. It wouldn't let me do it like I normally do. So here's this piece. 
um, yeah, I feel like it hooks down. So this is probably how it's gonna be. But I think if I'm gonna use it with this sign, looking at it now, it doesn't match very well. I think I need to paint it all the way out. But anyway, that's what I've been playing with tonight. I've been working on orders. Um, I had a few texts for people wanting some signs made that they didn't get yesterday. So I've been working on that. You see a swan, I see, I see a comment. Um, hey, Barbara. So yeah, I, um, there's all kinds of things, but I just, once I saw that animal, I can't, I can't unsee it. So let me see if I see any other questions or that's the only comment I saw. Oh, there's Kathy. Kathy loves it. Sue. Um, great idea. Uh, you think it would be cute too? I do too. I think the hanger would be a really good idea for it. Um, who said that? Kathy. Thank you, Kathy. So, Hey Becky. Hello. Hello. Uh, and Janet. Hi, Janet and Sarah. And Julie's new. Well, hello, Julie. I'm just jumping on really fast. And there's Patri or, um, Teresa. She likes it. And Melinda likes it. Hi, Deborah. Um, that's really all I wanted. I love the stencil. Thank you, Kathy. It turned out so pretty. Um, hey, Esmeralda. I'm glad you jumped on. Hi, Cindy. Uh, and Norma. Hello, Norma. And hi, Terry Reno. Okay, I said hi to everybody that said hello there. I'm zipping you up. Make sure I didn't miss any. And Deborah loves it. Yay! So, okay, you guys, I'm not going to be on long range. He just walked in the door. He's been out of town. So I'm going to go um, visit with him. But I just wanted to show you this. I'm so proud of it. It's just so pretty. And I'm thankful to Kathy for that diamond dust. Um, it's sure. Oh, how can you find it? I got to hit the light just right. There we go. I got to hit the light just right for you to see it. But look how pretty that is. It's little pieces of glass. It's not glitter. Um, so it just there. Whoa, that's really catching it now. There we go. Um, put some in the leaves and I put some in the flowers and then that gold metallic wow that band on the sides woohoo so I've got it I still have to perfect it a little bit literally I just finished it in the group I asked the girls if they minded if I came over here to um, show this to you guys I like you know I always do things in my group and I told them I it's been a long time since I've done my anything over here since I started that group years ago so they agreed it was perfectly great. So you guys have a great night. It's nice to see you. Um, thank you, Deborah. Thanks, Sarah. Thanks again, Kathy. You guys have a great night. And I have a little something else I want to bring you. Um, I'm going to try to do it tomorrow. I have some things to do in the morning, um, but I'm going to try to bring it to you tomorrow. So um, be watching. I'll text those of you that are on my text line and uh, give you a heads up because I just don't know how my day is going to be. So um Oh, thank you, Terry. It's the best little group. I take all my stuff over there and I always feel, um, I used to always feel bad when I would do things over here because I had the girls over there wanting to see things and then I just got so used to doing it over there. I, I don't do a lot over here and I need to do that. Um, nice to see you, Esmeralda. Um, yes, yes, I'm gonna go uh, get his laundry rolling. <laughs> so have a good night, you guys. And thank you for watching. Uh, oh, Shayla wants it. <laughs> oh, Terry Reno. I think it was Terry Reno already claimed it, Shayla. I'll have to make you another. All right, you guys. Good night.